I try to run a John Ford film, one or two, before I start every movie, simply because he inspires me, and uh, and I'm I'm very sensitive to the way he uses his camera to paint his pictures and the way he frames things and and the way he stages and blocks his people, often keeping the camera static while the people give you the illusion there's a lot more kinetic movement occurring when there's not. So, you know, in, in that sense, he was a, he's like a classic painter, you know, and he celebrates the frame, not just, uh, you know, what happens inside of it. And so I, I, I just, I have to look at the searchers, have to, almost every time. And, and there's some other films like The Informer that I have to look at. And, and films like Tobacco Road, which I love. I really admire Stagecoach because, for one thing, it was John Ford's first foray into Monument Valley. So he was starting to use landscape art to, to help tell his story, to, to create God's country, and to put little figures in a grand landscape. And he began to bring nature into his films. Uh, and and uh, more than any of, his, any of his silent movies, you know, this was where he really began to use nature as a character. In his pictures, and I also like like when the guy has the Bible open, the arrow goes through the book into his heart. That's pretty cool. <laughs>